My name is Adam Steinbauer. I work for Crop Production Services. Uh, we're an ag retail outlet. We sell chemicals, seed, and fertilizer direct to farmers. Um, we're in Morrow County, Ohio, uh, which is about an hour north of Columbus, Ohio. We service about a 40 mile radius in this area. We are very confident in ESN. Uh, we've been using the product for roughly five years at this facility. We are roughly 85 to 90 percent ESN on all of our nitrogen sales. We like to incorporate it pre-plant. The great thing about that is using the ESN, it alleviates the side dress trip. Side dressing nitrogen is is cumbersome. The weather is a big factor on whether we can get in the field or not. ESN, you know, breaks up the workload. It's a one and done type of application. We know if we put ESN out there, we're going to get the full maximum usage out of the product. Uh, if we put 100 units of nitrogen in the ESN form, we're going to get 100 units. Uh, zero volatility, it's convenient. We can cover a lot more acres in a day versus applying anhydrous or side dressing. It's really performed well for our soil type in this area. It flat out means bushels. Um, we've done a lot of side-by-side -side trials with ESN versus other nitrogen sources and 90% of the time we are coming out on top. But we're seeing anywhere from a 5 to a 30 bushel increase by using ESN over other nitrogen sources. The spoon feeding effect that ESN has on the corn crop, uh, once it does start to release in the V5 to V7 stage, it'll slowly provide nitrogen to that crop through the tassel stage. The corn crop needs the most nitrogen in that stage and ESN releases mimically to, to when that corn crop needs the fertilizer. ESN uh, is slowly available every day and that's why we're seeing the yield advantage um, in this crop and, and the customers are, are thrilled.